Jack Cardiff, one of the greatest directors of photography ever, um, lit some of the most famous movies. Um, he described that as his favourite lamp. Mm -hmm. And what's more, the, the, the glamorous lady actresses that, that he specialised in lighting mm -hmm. loved, it, loved that as well. And he'd mm -hmm. get the whole thing, the whole set lit, the person lit, and then he'd bring in that inky. Mm -hmm. And he'd just put a tiny little soft bar of light across the eyes. If you watch some of those old movies, you can see the, that, that done. And it just brought the face to life mm. and the eyes to life. And the, and the, the ladies loved it. They would, they would ask, for, have you got my little inky? Yes, you know. that's right. Yeah. Uh, the, uh, the one that was mentioned earlier today, we used to use, in the, in the black and white days often, ladies wore uh, a gown that always revealed the shoulders and it cut off there. And, and the, you've got the whole shoulders and the chest. And um, a cameraman, one cameraman decided that he needed a, a means of just keeping a light off these white shoulders. So he produced a small flag, which went on a proper stand and arm and that, and it just took all the whiteness off the top of the body. And this cameraman's name was Charlie. Forever after, it was Charlie called a bar. Charlie bar. <laughs> <laughs> I actually, I actually had a different version of that. Did you have oh, yeah. well, I heard that Charlie, a David version? Well, Charlie was uh, was a well-known um, uh, slang word. Was it oh. for the same thing as Bristol and another? Was it? Well -known. Oh, well, I didn't know that. So it was known as a Charlie bar because yeah. it actually kept yeah. the light off the off the yeah. bosom. Yeah. Well, when but I went into Ealing Studios, uh, when it was well, quite a way back now, and it had uh, been. Um, some of the old Ealing Sparks are still there, but I found um, a thing in that studio was when they lit in those black and white days and the electricians were up on the gantries, it used to get very noisy. And to tell electricians what you wanted up on the gantry was very difficult. And it meant spotting and flooding the lamp. And I found this handle with uh, a dial on it and the gaffer would show this to the guy up on the gantry and it would it would start um wide flood, yeah. full flood for the lamp and it would slowly go in divisions getting hotter and hotter as you spotted the lamp up and the guy up there could see this and when it got to the very end of the hottest it had one more division and it was dying of doors. <laughs>